Okay, so now looking at the side of the skull. So again, frontal bone up front here, parietal bone, temporal bone. You can see kind of the sphenoid bone right here as well. And the lacrimal bone is uh, right here inside, just inside the nose. Okay, and the zygomatic bone. Now our zygomatic bone has three processes. So you can think of these processes as named after what they touch, not what bone they're on. So this projection here, okay, this is the temporal process because it touches the temporal bone. This projection off to this side, okay, this is my maxillary process because it touches the maxillary bone. Uh, then you have your orbital process up on top, so this projection touches right here where the orbital is, uh, so that's your orbital process. On the temporal bone, you have this process here, touches the zygomatic bone, so it makes it our zygomatic process. Okay, you can see down here, this large protrusion here, uh, that's the mastoid process. You have a large hole here where your ear would be. Uh, this is your external auditory meatus. Okay, so along our mandible, Okay, so the mandible, again, you can see that mental foreman right up there uh, in the front. You can see the ramus, which is kind of this whole region right here. Okay. The mandibular uh, condyle. So that's what comes back here, connects to the back of the jaw. The mandibular angle is down here. The choroid cornoid process uh, is this front projection. So you have cornoid and mandibular condyle. 